Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. So, uh, I'm back after a very long time, and with but with a very very interesting uh, topic, and I'll discuss it very shortly. Bose-Einstein condensation. So, let me quickly tell you what is this Bose-Einstein condensation. Bose-Einstein condensation occurs when you know a gas okay is cooled to very low temperature okay nearly to zero okay so it is another state of matter bose einstein condensation is another state of matter now what happens here the particles when the gas is cooled to very low temperature there, there are certain atoms many atoms in the gas so for example you have rubidium 87 okay one such gas so you can make a BEC, bose einstein condensate out of rubidium 87. So what is happening is the gas, the atoms of the gas, okay, they are so much that they are not able to feed themselves in the ground state. So what happens normally is then the atoms they squeeze themselves among themselves to fit in the ground state, okay, and uh, this is then you have the BEC. So what happens? Even the uh, wave functions are become similar when they have to fit in once because there are so many atoms and they are not able to fit themselves in the, in the ground state. So they they try to adjust in uh, in the ground state by squeezing themselves, and as a result, they also tend to acquire similar wave functions. That is why the shape of BEC sometimes seen like this is a type of very sharp pointed hill like this okay now so what happened this is the state and the, so the state of matter here what we what we get is bose einstein condensate so let me just uh, tell you briefly what is the history about this it was uh, in 1924 when professor satinath bose of uh, india that time he used to he was a professor of physics of the dhaka university and he was very renowned there uh, just let me tell you a fun fact. Professor Satnayat Bose was not well versed in statistical mechanics, so he used his own ways of combinatorics to study the physics of statistical mechanics. And he wrote, he sent a letter to Professor Albert Einstein about certain uh, theories of his, in which uh, the idea of BEC was there. Einstein later generalized this theory, and uh, later, when it was proved, then it was a huge and cry among all scientists that it was a very great achievement for the theoretical physics community. So it was named as Bose Einstein condensate. It was in the year 1995 when it was finally seen that BEC really occurs. So this is a, this is a very hot topic in the field of theoretical physics about Bose Einstein condensate. I hope I could just briefly tell you about everything as to what really is Bose Einstein condensate. So Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa